What's up, good people? How you doing? Welcome back to Stock Up with Larry Jones. Hey, if you're new to the page, go ahead and hit the like, subscribe, and notification bell. And if you've been rolling with me for a while, go ahead and hit the like button. Today, we're going to talk about um, four stock that I asked four different YouTubers to submit as their best stock if you only can pick four. So that meant stock, ETFs, and, and funds, like mutual funds, okay? I gotta start saying stuff like, you know, I'm not your financial advisor, and the things that I am suggesting that you take a look at are not a suggestion to buy or sell. And uh, so I'm gonna start saying that, okay, good people? I made a video uh, on yesterday talking about um, this weekend. And remember, if you're in a high conviction uh, play, meaning you in a high conviction long-term stock, I, I think you should not sell. And uh, I got a, a lot of people asking about crypto. Remember, look at the date of when this is posted. I am not selling any of my crypto, even if the mar market, even if it goes through another flash crash, I'm not selling any of my crypto, good people. I'm keeping it. I'm just going to buy more if that happens, all right? So let's get right into it. I'm going to start with my brother, my good brother, Stock Mo. I'm going to leave a link below to um, the two of these gentlemen actually made videos after they made this, after, sorry, after they received the call that I put out to them. And the first is my brother, Stock Mo. Y'all know Stock Mo, is, he's, he's my twin brother. <laughs> and uh, I love that brother because I love his opening statement. I want you guys to go over to his page and look at his opening statement. And I want you to go to their perspective pages and see why they choose the stock, okay? And I think you're gonna be surprised by the list and I think you're gonna be surprised by why they choose the stock. Let's go over here, all right? So I'm trying not to get a reflection. So the first stock that Stockmo picked is DraftKings, uh, ticker symbol DKNG, DraftKings. Let me put these back on, all right? That's Stockmo's first pick, right? Now, these are not limited to these four and all of the YouTubers, uh, you know, these are not limited to these four, but I limited them to four stock. So his first one is DraftKings. His second one is Tesla, ticker symbol TSLA. DraftKings, the ticker symbol is DKNG. I will have a list of all of these stock at the bottom, okay? And I'll have the prospective names of who picked them. All right, Stockmo's third list his third stock on the list is ticker symbol DIS, Walt Disney Company, okay? That was a surprise to some of you guys, I know. His fourth one is ticker symbol C-O-I-N, coin as in Coinbase. Coinbase is Stockmo's fourth stock. So let's go over Stockmo's pick. DraftKings, Tesla, Walt Disney Company, and Coinbase. Now, Stockmo actually um, also gave a bonus and the bonus was very interesting and I'll explain that at the end. It is extremely interesting. Stockmo's bonus stock pick is VOO, which is Vanguard S&P 500, okay? It's an ETF, you're buying the, the overall market, all right? So you're buying uh, uh, the, the S&P 500 is what you're buying, all right? So let's keep it moving, all right? Thank you, Stock Mo. You're the best, my friend. We will be getting together. If I have to come and hunt you down and come pick you up like the, Bruce, the Blues Brothers, I'm coming for you, Stock. So yeah, we're gonna make it happen. It's just so many things going on. I love you, brother. Thanks for the call. Thanks for answering the call. And uh, we'll be in touch. What I initially said is if they were discounted by 10%. So remember that for stock modes picks also. 
discounted by 10%. And Stock Curry gave 15 and then he gave his top four. Overachiever you. <laughs> so here's what Stock Curry did. Here's his, here's his picks. Let me go to this camera. Stock Curry's picks are VWAGY, ticker symbol, VWAGY, that's Volkswagen, all right? Uh, the second one is ticker symbol VALE, that's VEL. His third one is ticker symbol GS, that's Goldman Sachs. And his fourth ticker symbol is CLF. Cleveland Cliffs, and you will find this one extremely, extremely uh, interesting. Um, and you say, a lot of you, you are saying, I've never even heard of that. I will tell you that I learned this from Stock Curry. It has a PE ratio of 4.0. And um, just go to Stock Curry's page, look at it, See why he picked it, and I believe you'll be surprised to put this on your list, right? Let's keep it going. Uh, Matt Coors, I put the call out to Matt Coors, and he texted me back. He, he's going to get to it. I think I'm going to have Matt Coors on the show, and then maybe we can talk about it then. Uh, he's busy. He's doing a lot of media. Everybody's pulling on him, so he's extremely busy. Get back at me, uh, Matt. Uncle Larry's calling, all right? <laughs> no, Matt is extremely, he, he told me he's, he's going to do it. He's just trying to find some time. I understand. Trust me, with these 80-hour weeks, is no joke. All right, let's keep it going. The third gentleman, I'm sorry, the fourth gentleman, his name is Ian Dunlap. Ian Dunlap. Now, he didn't make a video yet because he's going to actually be on the show. Now, his top four stock pick Goes as follows. VUG, it's Vanguard Growth Index. VOO, there it is again. That's why it's interesting. Vanguard S&P 500 ETF. AAPL, ticker symbol, AAPL. That's Apple. And his fourth stock pick is MSFT, Microsoft. Now, remember, these gentlemen are, uh, are influencers, just like I am. They're YouTubers, just like I am. And remember, you have to do your own research and your own due diligence. This was just a question that I asked them and they answered. They're not your financial advisors. I want to say that for them. All right. But remember, I, I, I asked if they were at a 10% discount. OK, so let me give you mine. My top four is ticker symbol AAPL, that's Apple. My second one is ticker symbol VOO, that's Vanguard, the S&P 500 ETF. So that's in three of our uh, stop, st top stock picks, all right? My fourth one, I want to stretch out a little bit, is Tesla, T-S-L-A. Tesla is a game changer. Tesla and Apple are world changers. And I believe that you should have these in your portfolio long term, 10, 20 years. These are retirement stock. These are never sales stock to me. OK, these are set it and forget it stock that you should buy in a bull market, a, bound, a, a, a bear market, a, a crash, a correction. You just keep dollar cost averaging in in these stocks. And you will create generational wealth. That's why I asked for this list. OK. Um, and so my uh, my actually my bonus was GM uh, GS Goldman Sachs, which was in Stock Curry's uh, uh, stock pick. So GS Goldman Sachs is my bonus pick because I believe that everyone should have some banking um, so you'll have something to rotate into, right? And uh, so you got to look at their charts year over year. I believe over the, a five-year period, let alone a 10-year period, 
I believe you're going to wish that you had add, added this. So I have some things that have a past where you can chart it like uh, Tesla and especially Apple. So you can literally pull up a chart and see what it's done over the last 20 years. Uh, but you can't with ARC because it's only like five years old. But I like it because it has disruptive technology, you know, fintech, uh, gene therapy, biogen genetics. Um, uh, autonomous driving, 3D printing. Um, these are the things of the future and I'm about investing in the future. Trends make wealth. Trends make, make uh, I would say trends will make a lot of millionaires if you invest in trends early. All right, good people. So now let me say this. I believe that Starting right now, for those of you that are already following my $5 cup of coffee, remember I got it here, $5 cup of coffee. For those of you that's already following that, continue to follow, continue to dollar cost average in. As a matter of fact, when the market goes red, you're actually buying it at a discount, good people. And so I say continue to dollar cost average in, but if, and remember, I, I set it up as $5 a day. But if you want to take uh, a cocktail of what these gentlemen suggest and start another $5 a day, you could do it with your same trading platform or open up another, a new tr uh, sorry trading platform and do the $5 a day there. Now you're investing $10 a day. Some of you can do 20. Some of you can do 50, 100, $1,000 a day. Some of you that's following me. I know some of you can, but if you can do, you know, $20 a day, then do $20 a day. Remember, this is just a suggestion to build financial wealth. Time in the market is going to outperform you trying to time the market, good people. So I hope you've learned something from this. I have. And uh, I'm going to continue to learn and bring this type of stuff to you. So remember, good people, um, if you don't have a trading platform, and even if you do, I suggest having multiple plat platforms. Um, if I suggest Weeble to you, I have a link below for Weeble. And then for your crypto, I have Coinbase and I have BlockFi. A lot of people have went to BlockFi and opened up, but I will tell you, just deposit $100 in all three because eventually you're going to want to stake your crypto and so and you want to earn interest on your crypto and BlockFi is a great platform for that. But as far as Coinbase is concerned, that's where I get all my altcoins from. OK, and so uh, look, this, think about that. And then if you want to swing trade crypto, you can actually swing trade crypto with the Weeble app. I'm going to leave links to the videos because I want you to watch their videos. All right. Watch the entire videos, Stock Mo and Stock Curry, because they show you why. And I believe you will have an eye opening moment. All right, good people. Hey, we're going to leave it right there. Remember to check out all of the links and at the top of the links and the top of the description, I'm going to leave a link to my brand new page, Larry Jones TV. And for those of you that are brand new to the market, I want to show you how to spend five dollars a day and to profit. I'm sorry. And to build wealth and set it on automatic while you're not even thinking about it, while you're at work, while you're going about your day, your money making money for you. All right. Hey, we love you guys. Live, love, laugh and learn.